Hello, I'm Dana Cowley and welcome to Charter Local Edition Northwest. Today we're in Olympia and we're talking to our lawmakers about the bills they're working on this session. My guest today is our Republican Representative Terry Neely. He represents the 16th District in Southeastern Washington. Terry, thank you for joining us. I appreciate it. Thank you. Glad to be here. Since our voters in the state have legalized marijuana, you are working on several bills that could handle how this is going to move forward in our state. Correct. Initiative 502 was passed by the people a year ago by about 56 percent uh, to legalize marijuana. And I want to first say that I am against the use of marijuana, always have been, probably always will be. But it's now in front of us. It's been legalized. I serve on the Finance Committee. I also serve on the Judiciary Committee. So I've seen a lot of bills come through that deal with this marijuana issue. Mm -hmm. The taxing of it to begin with is 25% tax against the grower, 25% against the processor, 25% retail. Then there's sales tax. Mm -hmm. So you can see it's a lot of tax on this marijuana. One of our concerns is how do you set the price of the marijuana knowing there's going to be a heavy tax and have it compete with the black market. Mm -hmm. That's one of the big issues that, that we've had to deal with. The other issue that's come up is the medical marijuana users. And they have quite a strong force, believe it or not. There's a lot of medical marijuana users, and they say that it really does help them. We've got to be careful that we don't change the price for medical marijuana, even though they think there shouldn't be any tax on it, because it's like a medicine or a prescription. Mm -hmm. We feel that would be a big mistake, at least most of us on the Finance Committee, because if there's a disparity between the prices, you can guess what's going to happen. They're all going to go buy the one that doesn't have the tax on it and that's going to really mess up the system. What do you think is the best solution there? Well, the Liquor Control Board has been blessed with the job of you know, coming up with all the, the plans of implementing this issue. And I think they've done a pretty good job, uh, but we've got to take our time in coming up with those answers. Uh, one bill that we passed out of committee was to give the medical marijuana users uh, sales tax exemption so they don't pay that nine or ten percent that's the mm -hmm. only break that they get uh, but it's interesting that they came in and testified they don't like to be merged or be with the recreational growers they want to be completely separate they don't oh. want to be associated with the recreational growers are you reviewing what's happening in Colorado when Colorado moved ahead with this it was such a big cash generator for that state and it continues to be one apparently so and uh, our liquor control board is looking at Colorado because they're a little bit ahead of us time-wise in implementing some of these policies so yes uh, we're definitely looking at those policies also. And I know some of our growers in the state are looking at seeing how they can make a profitable uh, there sure are, but there, out of that. But there's a lot of problems. The federal government says marijuana is still illegal. Mm -hmm. uh, many of our cities and counties have put a moratorium on selling it, not allowing uh, to be sold in the, a county or a city. Mm -hmm. The attorney general came out about two weeks ago and said, uh, with an attorney general's opinion that yes, cities and counties can control their own situation. So if we do come up with a tax, then do we share that is another issue with any of the cities and counties who have to deal with this in their own area with law enforcement and so forth. So there's a lot of tough issues that we've got to resolve. All right, Terry, thank you for taking the time to come talk with us. Thank you. This is Terry Neely. I'm Dana Cowley in Olympia, and you're watching Charter Local Edition Northwest.